Let's get into this melt in your mouth pot roast. Here we go. We're going to use a chuck roast. This is about a pound and a half. And we're going to season it liberally with kosher salt and lots of black pepper. We're going to season it on both sides and get in every nook and cranny. Then in a Dutch oven, we're going to add some oil and sear it on both sides until golden brown, just like this. That's about five minutes per side without touching it. Then we're going to remove it from the pan and we're going to add some veggies. I'm doing celery, onions, garlic, carrots, potatoes a little later on. We're going to season it up every single layer. Get some seasoning, salt, pepper, and Herbe de Provence. That's brown girl spice, y'all. Stay tuned. Coming soon. Then we're going to go ahead and add the pot roast back in. We're going to go in with some beef broth. We bake it at 300 degrees for three hours and you get this beautifully cooked melt in your mouth as soft as butter pot roast. Five small red potatoes cut in cubes, one to three pound pot roast, our baby carrots and potatoes going in our bacon casserole dish, half of a yellow onion, half of a red onion cut in chunks, one celery stick cut in small pieces, roasted garlic nature seasoning, two tablespoons of each. We have two to three tablespoons of olive oil, two to three sprinkles of sea salt, half of a teaspoon of rosemary adobo garlic powder and onion powder sprinkle two to three shakes across and we're going to have a fourth of a cup of worcestershire sauce pour it throughout two to three cups of beef broth pour it throughout half a cup no fourth of a cup of minced garlic sprinkle black pre pepper paprika and we're going to sprinkle the parsley on top for some pretty color mix everything up really well and voila she is ready to go in the oven Cover this baby, put it on 350 for three hours, and look at this gorgeous dish. Hi friends, pot roast today in the Instant Pot, so easy. In here I have a giant white onion that I've sliced up, and I'm adding a two and a half pound chuck roast, whichever is the cheapest, toughest piece of beef you can find. Next, I'm adding my spices. You can put whichever ones you like, but I like one package of the onion soup mix and one package of ranch dip mix. Okay, onion soup is in. Here's the ranch dip mix. One jar of sliced banana peppers, mild or hot, whatever you like, plus all the liquid in there. One jar of water. We added eight ounces of butter, and now we're gonna pressure cook for 34 minutes a pound. The pot roast is done, and I just wanna show you how tender this is. I can literally pull it apart with a fork. The meat just comes apart so easily. If you want to add vegetables, just put some carrots and potatoes in here and put the pot on saute for about 10 minutes. Hey y'all, I wanted something quick today. So this morning I threw a pork roast in the crock pot. I'm gonna put a pack of French onion soup and a pack of au jus gravy. A diced onion, some garlic and Worcestershire sauce, of course, and about two cups of water. I'm going to cut up some red potatoes and some carrots, and I'm just going to let it cook on slow all day. I added a couple seasonings, too. Y'all, this is one of the best roasts I make. I just, we absolutely love it, and it feeds so much. I made some cornbread to go with it, and it's just wonderful, especially for a fall dinner. We had a super fun day picking out things for our new addition. If you saw on Instagram, we are adding another one to the Morcel family, and no, I'm not pregnant. <laughs> I hope y'all had a wonderful Thursday. I love y'all and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Get ready guys, I got a good recipe for you today. We're gonna to be making Mississippi pot roast in the crock pot. First, you're gonna add your chuck roast to a crock pot. I got a two pounder here. Then we're gonna to top that with a ranch seasoning packet, just sprinkle it all over the top. Then an au jus gravy packet, sprinkle that over the top. Then I'm gonna take one fourth cup of butter that I've sliced up and place that over the top. Now we're gonna place a few pepperoncinis. I love this, put as much or as little, how, whatever you want, whatever floats your boat. I like to add a little juice from this also. I don't know, maybe fourth a cup worth. Cover and cook on low for seven to eight hours. When it's done, go ahead and shred it up. Then I like to cover and let it kind of sit for another 10, 15 minutes. And then serve, I like mine over mashed potatoes. First things first, easy pot roast. First thing you're gonna do is lather that piece of meat up with some oil. Doesn't matter what type of oil, avocado, canola, olive, everything's good. Then you're gonna throw some salt, some cayenne, some pepper, anything you want, up to you. Yeah, shake that shit up. God 
Damn, that cayenne looks tasty. Dude, this is taking up so much time. Can I stop it? Mmm. I think I don't want to put this baby on the heat real quick, no problem. Let it each side get nice and brown, nice and warm. Jesus, everything I cook looks good. I'm going to throw this bad boy in the pot. Grab something to mix with, throw in all these ingredients. I'll list them above. Pour it in there, easy. Cut these carrots up nice and, nice and tight. Throw the potatoes and carrots in there, no problem. Mix it up, it's in the middle of cooking, looks good, looks good. Whammo, ready to go. We cooking some pot roast today. Poke some holes in it and take the garlic and put it in there. Cause we cooking this thing good. Ooh, close it. After you put a few garlic pieces in there, you are gonna season it. Mushroom gravy and half a cup of water and we're gonna mix it. Oh. I added in pearl onions, carrots, and some potatoes for the last hour. In the meantime, in between time. Ooh. Um, people of color mm. who are, who are mm. black. Wow. 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 Oh, shit. Okay. okay. Bye, All right. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Ah. Oh. oh. Good, Whitney? She loves really it. Mm -hmm. First you get a roast. Then you take your anger out. Stuff it with garlic. Then you put it in a crock pot on a bed of onions. Oops, forgot to show you guys the bed of onions. Ranch packet. Butter. These things. Blah, 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 blah. More onions. Mmm. 